Right, just do this whole thing again? All over again, yeah. Right. Like so not, and by the way, I'm kidding. Everyone at home, Logan <laughs> has been in therapy every single day. He's very hurt, and uh, I'm sure he's very distraught about yeah. this injury. It's a real injury. Yes, it is. So we're going to go down to the track right now. The 1,600-meter run is just getting oh, off. Now, this is the endurance one. This oh, is a we've full got Summer mile, Ray basically. Summer Rae is on the ground. She's falling. And this is going to test their endurance more than anything. Does that guy not know he can go into the inside of the track? He, he might not. These guys are YouTubers and Instagram influencers. He's, he's staying out there. Well, you want to jockey for position early. It looks like the pack is spreading out a little bit. Yeah, that guy has no idea he can leave his lane. Now I believe. Oh, he figured it out. Now I believe Spencer Taylor, the third uh, impulsive host, is in this. He is a long distance runner. He has run uh, a couple Ironmans, and so I'm watching him right now to see when he turns the, the heat on. He's right here in the third position. Okay, so he's just kind of conserving energy right now. You think is he a sprinter toward the end? Summer Ray is doing cartwheels right now. Oh, we've, okay, so we've got Ryan Garcia and at Jeff Wittek, or at Jeff on Instagram and leading right now. Um, Ryan Garcia, the, the endurance you know, champion boxer extraordinaire, he's, he's leading right now, and I'm not so sure he's going to give this back, guys. My mic's open. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's not Summer Rae, by the way. I saw the no, cheetah. that's not Summer Rae, I saw Mike. the cheetah shorts. I but apologize. Yeah, I'm on. So as they cross the first lap of the 1,600 meters, you just have 1,200 to go. And this is where it gets tough. The heat's pounding down, but we got two separating from the pack. Yep, that's at Jeff and, and great cartwheels. Uh, who is that, Allie? Do you know who's doing the cartwheels? I think cartwheels? she's got to work on her form a little bit. Uh, she looks she looks hurt, but it's definitely not Summer Rae. No, They're I know just it's in not the same Summer shirt, Okay, shorts. apologies there, well, but, we did, but we did have some nice cartwheels. At Jeff, I'm very impressed by at Jeff, uh, Jeff Wittex, um, you know, staying with Ryan Garcia. And we just keep showing this this poor hurt woman in the back here. Now, how did Spencer do? Let's, let's Spencer's talk about in Spencer. Spencer's in the third spot. Uh, Spencer's dropped back behind Ryan Trahan right now. Okay. But all eyes are really on at Jeff to see if uh, the power of uh, the vlog squad could pull through here. David Dobrik probably at home rooting him on. And they're about to lap this poor woman. I think we got a little bit of a runway show going yeah, on now. I think now. we've got a yes. more of, I, I wouldn't call it a runway show. I'd call it a security risk. I'm pretty sure we need security in lane three to remove this. A stretcher. Yep. Oh, and she's picking it back up now. Yep. Now she thinks she's winning the race. She is running and, and, and you know, by the looks of it, she's, she's taking this thing home. That is, that is dedication. <laughs> and she's about to get lapped. Last time I saw somebody get lapped was in Mario Kart on N64. This is just, this is incredible. We need her out of the way. Yeah, oh, there she goes. She's pulling off exit 13. I'm sure there's a Chick-fil-A over there or something. And the race continues. Now what happened here? We had a slight, is there a trade here? We've got Ryan Garcia still leading the way, but who is this? I believe that's Ryan Trahan. Is that Ryan Trahan? Yes, that's Ryan Trahan. Uh, he also had a career as a track and field runner back in the day. But as you can see, Ryan Garcia is not giving up. And Spencer looks very good too. Spencer's really hanging in there and I think he may turn the Jets on. He's, he's got a career here. Yeah, I think he's waiting till the very end to, to give it to him. He that, doesn't want to show off too much, you know? That's not Spencer's vibe. That said, he is plant-based and uh, he's probably running out of fuel at this point since he hasn't eaten a carb or a uh, piece of meat since yeah, 2002. Except, you know, Mike, he started some beef with me today on Twitter, so I don't really know if I'm rooting for him. I wouldn't call it beef, Allie. He is, like I said, he's plant-based. So if anything, it would be an impossible burger. Okay, okay. So we are coming toward the last 400 meters of this race and the Competition is thinning out a little bit. It is a tough race. It's one mile, basically, of running. And in this heat, it's got to be tough out there for the challengers, especially the ones that have competed in multiple games. But that's going to bring us to thanking Fashion Nova. Thank you. And become your own fashion icon with Fashion Nova today. Check them out, Fashion Nova. Mike's already on it. Shout out, Fashion Nova. <clears throat> Lauren Descala, by the way, is the girl who's leading, but I mean, this is this couldn't be closer. Wow, this is, now it looks like Ryan, is Ryan Trahan and Ryan Garcia, two Ryans, uh, what are the chances, are pulling away with this. Ryan Garcia, I mean, I wouldn't want to be the guy that beats Ryan Garcia, by the way, he could really sock you. Well, Ryan Garcia, maybe he's conserving a little bit of energy. You mentioned he's the boxer. Yep. So he's used to running these long distances. My goodness, the security risk is back on the track. Chick-fil-A works fast. Yep. And it looks like Ryan Garcia on the outside. 
and Ryan Trahan in the inside. They got a jockey for position here. It's coming down to the final lap. It looks like Trahan's turning the heat up a little bit on Ryan Garcia. But of course, we just keep going back to this woman in the back here. And here we <laughs> go. It looks like Trahan, Trahan but Garcia is really making a push. Wow. But that. Trahan with the impressive Polo afterburners the oh right my there. Goodness. Looking like an Olympic runner out there as Ryan he takes Trahan. it with ease. Ryan Trahan, impressive 1600. He is the champion for this event, followed closely by Ryan Garcia. So the yep. Ryans take one and two. And then who do we have as the, as the female winner? Allie, you might be able to help. And Spencer coming over the uh, over the finish line now. Uh, boy, do I love Spencer Taylor. What a great guy. Great job, Ryan Trahan. YouTube star, marketing genius. And we got some other competitors hey finishing up right hey now. Hey, sweetheart. How are you? And it's tough to finish this event. Honestly, like a f dead sprint, 1,600 meters in this heat. It is, uh, it's tough to accomplish, and hats off to everyone who's participating in the 1,600 meters. That's not the one I would want to participate in, but you got to give it up to these folks. Well, not in this weather either, Thomas. I mean, it, I don't remember it being this hot since the last uh, Stone Age. Um, you, could, you could fry an egg on the, on the turf right now and possibly even cook a, a large turkey if you had to. And I feel like competitors are just coming out of nowhere at this point. Yeah, I don't believe either any, any of these people were even in the race. I'm pretty sure they just jumped in about halfway through. Um. Well, here we go. This is oh, the wow. start of the event, and, and they're coming out a little bit slow. And you'll see the girl uh, on the left just trip and take an absolute tumble. <laughs> Take an absolute tumble. But you got to love her being a good sport about it. There she up, goes yep. on the runway. Flex a pose. Bam. Just absolutely incredible. What an athlete. What an overall competitor. And just it's, it's incredible to watch her move from uh, athleticism to runway modeling to just overall, you know, being the biggest security risk we've had so far. So kind of the Challenger Games triple threat. Runner, model, security S threat. Security threat. That's correct. Yes. Yes, Thomas. Oh, wow, we've got Ryan Garcia walking over here. So we actually have Shannon with the winner of the event. Oh. We're going to go to Shannon right now. Hey, let's go, Chum. I'm here with the winner, Ryan, man. You did a phenomenal job. What a race, man. Talk to the people at home. All right. Uh, yeah, thanks, guys. That was a tough one. Shout out to Ryan Garcia for taking the win the whole time. Yeah. Uh, that was fun. I used to run in high school. It's fun to get back on the track. Man, you really pulled away. It was like no, nothing I, I've seen. I, I've been running all my life as a boxer, and that was the one that was incredible, man. You do this often, I, I, obviously. Yeah, I mean, I used to run all the time in high school, but lately, I mean, I put on like 30 pounds since then. So Ooh, wow. I was pretty happy with that. I was surprised. Okay, okay. What, what charity do you want to give a shout out to? So I'm donating to Front Steps Austin. Uh, we raised $20,000 a few weeks ago. Let's go, Chad. Those guys playing Minecraft, and uh, it uh, basically helps all the homeless population in my city, and go. it's great. You're a real champion for that, man. It. You're a real champ. Let me get a let's go champ. Let's go. <laughs> there he is. Thank you, brother. 